Hello everybody, Mark McCray here. In today's video, I'm going to show a quick tip for speeding up your retopology process in Maya using Quadra. So I've already got the start of my chest in here. I've got my hands done. And if we go into object mode, turn off quad draw. And if we, no, oh, let's just isolate this mesh to make things a bit easier for ourselves. So we can see that my loops I've made sure to have at 16. And what we're going to do is bring in a cylinder. Let's scale that up, grab faces, get rid of those ones and delete the caps. Let's go back into object mode. Get that to match the same 16 loops or subdivisions that I have on my arm and my shoulders. And we are going to get this into place around our arm. Oh, and we can see I missed some of those faces. So let's just quickly get those now. I want that loop pretty much at the elbow and then I'm going to shift drag off to extrude and I'm going to rotate that so that it better matches my wrist. Shrink it down. Let's get that about into place. So we've got that done. And then what I want to do is have it selected. I'm going to go into front view and I'm going to center the pivot for it into my mid have it selected freeze transformations we're going to duplicate it scale it across so that it's mirrored refreeze. I'm just going to quickly soften normals here. And then we're going to combine all of these together. And once again, refreeze. You can rename that back to base mesh. And then we'll get this back into live view. Get symmetry back on. And we go back into our quad draw. And then we can see we we can start working with this and I'm going to turn on soft select and just relax these edges to my mesh we can see we're getting very quick, easy result. So when I start matching this up, I want to make sure that I've got my center line and get it in the right spot. So I'm going to follow this line, this loop, and I want to get it in the center of my hand. So I've got good flow all around my arm. And then I'm just going to start snapping these verts, getting everything into place. And we'll just quickly do this. And 
there we go a very quick and easy way to get your topology down on large areas of your mesh and then from here you'd want to go in and do some further cleanup get you know some nice geometry in for animation around your shoulders and elbows get that clean up in get everything set for the finished product and then you can do the same thing adding in large shapes through your torso and your legs and quickly get that topology down so that you can spend more time working on the detailed stuff to get your topology right hopefully this helps speed up your process hit the like button hit subscribe if you're not already a member of the channel so you can see more tips and videos have a great day everybody thanks for watching and thanks for all your support